Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a what is in my post video and um, I know these types of videos are really popular here on YouTube so I decided to make my own um, what's in my post video. So this is my post. Um, it is this pretty large white bag and it has brown detailing and gold accents. So, yeah, this bag is by the brand Capizio, if that's how you pronounce it. I'm really not sure. And I also got this for my grandma, and I don't know where she purchased this at. So, yeah, this is my bag, and this has three exterior pockets. Okay, so the first pocket in this... Um, I just keep my phone in this pouch because it's so easy to just grab. If you want me to do a what on my iPhone video, I definitely will. Okay, so then on, like, the top of the bag, they there are two pouches. One of them is a, um, like a button. This, like, a magnetic button for the first one. And, okay, so what I have in here is my little cheetah bag, and um, inside this bag I have my vlogging camera. Um, I don't use this one as much as I use the one that I'm filming on right now, but it would be great for, like, vlogging and stuff, and it is just the red Canon power shot and it's very easy to like very portable so the next thing that is in my bag is my little Sephora on the go bag this is essential for literally every girl's needs and I'm going to show you what I keep in mine so the first thing is deodorant I just love to have deodorant when I'm on the go. I think it is so convenient. And this is just the 24-hour um, protection. Okay, the next thing is a mascara for those just-in-case moments. Um, this one is The Colossal by Maybelline. This is the waterproof one. So... Okay, the next thing is a Lush sample, and these Lush samples are perfect sizes. Um, this is a hand cream, and I'm actually almost done with it. And it just smells so fresh, and I like to keep that when I'm on the go. The next thing is this Bath & Body Works Pocket Bag. Um, cookie dough, hand sanitizer, and I don't know how Bath & Body Works does it, but this one smells like completely identical to actual cookie dough, and it doesn't smell like fake or anything. It just smells perfectly like it. I got it on my nose. Okay, the next thing that I keep inside of my little Sephora on the go bag is this Boats Bees Beeswax Lip Balm or Lip Butter and um because you never know when you're gonna have chap lips okay the next thing is my all-time favorite ever baby lips and it is the Cherry Me um red baby lips and I smashed it at the top I know and I just love this baby lips it smells like cherries, and it just applies so smoothly with so much pigment. Definitely an on-the-go necessity. And I think the last product, yeah, this is going to be the last product in my little Sephora bag, um, is a little rollerball, just in case. And um, this is the Sky High Heel... Um, fruity floral perfume from Charlotte Russe, and it's just basic. And that is all that I keep inside of my Sephora on the go bag. I got this bag when they were having like a giveaway, um, so I'm not sure if you can actually get this, but if you just have any, um, 
small bag you can make a little on the go bag for yourself okay and then lastly in this pouch is my dark kiss body lotion by Bath and Body Works this is one of my favorite signature scents it just smells so like musky and it is awesome okay so next we're going to be moving on to the zippered um, part of the pocketbook and inside here all I keep is my wallet. I like to kind of separate my wallet from the whole bag so if I have receipts or extra change I can just throw it in there. And my wallet is this Vera Bradley wallet. I didn't catch the name. I think it's like something deco red in deco i don't even know but yeah it's this red white and black floral print all over it and in here i'm just gonna cover up my name so yeah i have my little child safety card and then inside is so cool it has this like it reminds me of just like tech um i have all my cards inside of here um, my Sephora beauty card, beauty points card. I have um, my PayPal. Like, I have a little bank card if I want to um, withdraw or deposit money into my bank. I have my library card, and I have this like um, rewards card. For when um, I get like my eyebrows or my lip threaded, I get like points on that card. So I don't have any money in my wallet right now because I just like store it in my room. And then in this little pouch, um, I just keep little things like more threading places, um, some receipts, deals, coupons. All that stuff and I keep chain so yeah I just keep my wallet in that section and it's really convenient and easy for me um, I hope you guys enjoyed the what is in my post video um, and yeah I'll just give you one last look of my post this is what it looks like and it has this large um, strap for like a crossbody bag. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you click the subscribe button, like, comment. Um, I also just recently made a Twitter page for my YouTube channel and I'll like give updates and stuff on there. So if you want to follow that, it's just at tips from Julie the same way that it's like written and stuff in my channel name. So yeah, be sure to check that out and yeah, hope you have a great day. See you guys next time. Bye.